All right, we're about to walk into another store, one that you love and one that you love for me to go shop in. So stay tuned. Let's see what they have and what they don't have. Welcome to our channel. Watch this video. Okay, walking in, we're going to walk around the produce aisle. We have one, two, three, four, seven pineapples. Not a bad price, though. $1.98, but they're so small. Good Lord. Uh, oh no, we got a few, a few more down here. So we got about 10, 11 out. Empty bin. This gentleman over here is stocking grapes. The... Okay, so that don't look bad. That cucumbers are out. But I see some empty bins, y'all, over here. Tomatoes. No, potatoes are empty. Oh, wow. Uh, white potatoes. I hope potatoes are empty. All right, so I always like to go to the pastry aisle. As you can tell, so lots a few empty spaces, especially right here. It's like your to tostados and your tortillas and things like that. Bread looks pretty good though. Empty spaces on the fruits. Bread don't look too bad, but right here in the the Dave's it's a little bare. Alright, prep alert, prep alert, prep alert, prep alert, prep alert. Prep alert right there. Came over here just to show some open spaces, okay? All right, we're on the can good aisle. Let's see, a couple open spaces. Great prep alert, prep alert. All right, so let's look at this right here. Apparently we got somebody on the other side getting in trouble. All right, let's see, canned goods are looking pretty light. All right, the great value. Bushes, awesome. And we got canned goods down here. 50 cents a can. I think at the last Walmart I was at, it was 38 cents a can. Uh, I came in looking for some rice and I, okay, so there's, all right, pinto beans. Eight pound bag is 564. Long grain rice, 20 pounds is 738. So what we're gonna do, all right, let me see which one is okay so this, this is amazing the eight pound and the four pound are exact exactly the same price so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna grab me personally I'm gonna grab uh, okay how much is okay so the two pound is two half a cents higher <laughs> That's funny, and the one pound is 98 cents, which is the most expensive. And we're gonna grab us a 20 pound bag of rice for seven bucks. So for 7.38 and 2.88, we're gonna grab 24 pounds of food. Golly, that's kind of heavy. Kind of heavy doing it by with one hand. Oh, that was a deadlift. All right, so. That's about all that's on this aisle. We're gonna look at beans and rice, rice and beans, beans and rice, rice and beans. I right, owe somebody down here before. So there we go. 38 cents a can for corn, 50 cents a can for sweet peas. Alright, and then it just goes up from there, okay? 50 cents a can for beans. Alright, so here's the Campbell's. Okay, looks pretty stock, pretty good pretty normal and then I always show you guys the progress so dollar fifty eight that's pretty normal okay and the chunky is dollar seventy eight all right the Roman noodle aisle is empty I don't know if they had a sale or not okay pasta pasta okay and sauce 
Okay, eggs, 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 looking kind of like they need some help. Yeah. All right, so ground beef. Uh, this guy's doing his job and entertaining at the same time. I told you guys there were going to be plenty of turkeys. Look at that, 68 cents a pound. Butter balls are 98 cents, and honeysuckle whites are 68 cents a pound. One thing we don't have to worry about. Chicken, it's looking kind of whatever. Pork, I wouldn't eat, even if I was eating meat. And there you have it. I'm gonna go past the frozen stuff, frozen meats. Don't look that bad. Waffles, always have an open space. All right, cool. Hey, this thing is catching on, and I want to thank our two partners. And we have a new two partner, so watch her video right after this. Hey, you guys, welcome to Plant Based Homestead Pepper. This is Miss Dasha family. Please check them out and subscribe to their channel. And y'all have a blessed day. All right, go check out Miss Deja family. <clears throat> also, go check out some of our other two partners, uh, Christina Grim Survival, uh, Jennifer's channel over at. Oh gosh, what is your channel name, Jennifer? It's so long. Uh, let me see. Something Warrior Forum, Heart Speak Warriors Forum with Jennifer Chappelle and uh, Six Acres. Go check her out as well. And check out our friends over there at Off Grid Desert Farming with Paul and Adrian. All right, we'll see you guys on the next one. Stay tuned. We're not done. All right, so we're walking out of, you don't see too many of those around here, the, Wal the neighborhood Walmarts. And I got 20 pounds of rice and four pounds of beans. And I was looking at it before, you know, as I was checking out. And this 20 pounds of rice, I didn't realize it was 202 serving sizes. So technically, if you're rationing out, um, this 20 pounds constitutes 202 servings. So in a pinch, now you're going to need a ton of water to do it. And these two items came up to $10.52, just so you know. Alrighty. And that's a lot of, I mean, think about it. In a, in a pinch, that's a lot of freaking food. 202 servings if you're doing you know let's just say you're doing one serving a day that's if for one person that's like 202 servings matter of fact I'm gonna show it to you because I have never read the back of it all right here we go let's turn the camera around and boop. all right so cooking instructions for fluffy for tender fluffy rice in a three-quart saucepan, combine blah, 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 blah. Simmer 15 minutes until the water is absorbed. Okay, fluff with fork and serve. For high attitudes, blah, 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 blah. Okay, so yield. Three cups, four servings. Six cup, eight servings. So one cup of rice uh, is, is that four servings? Wow. Okay, so you need two cups of water. You do butter and margarine, then do salt. Where was, oh, here it is. <clears throat> so 202 servings per container on this 20 pounds. Serving size is uh, a quarter cup. All right. And it's 160 calories. Carbohydrates. Get some iron. You know, well, not even, no potassium. All right. And... Long grain rice and which with ferric phosphate, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> okay. So rice, which, yeah, okay. I'm not going to give my opinion about rice. It's, it's great doing a prep. All right. So beans, I had never read the back of a back of a, a bean pack and probably a lot of you guys haven't either. So in this little four pound thing of beans, are 52 servings so this four pound so so if you if you wanted to have 
the same amount of beans as you do rice as far as servings you would need four times so that's uh, a 16 pounds of beans and if you did beans and rice every day and you did a serving okay you do a, it would be a hundred calories of beans and 160 calories of rice quick math that gives us 260 calories right which is not enough to sustain the average person but if you're rationing you need to do at least mm, i would say uh, 260 you can get away with three servings of each a day 260 quick math that's 520 plus another 260 that's like almost 800 right almost 800 it's not gonna get there you're gonna lose some weight but you will be alive all right so beans and rice rice and beans beans and rice rice and beans and we're gonna come back uh later within the next couple of days and i'm going to start dry canning a lot of these items so thank you for being here catch the next one Hey guys, it's Jennifer Chappelle with Heart Speak Warriors Forum. I hope you're enjoying all of the edutainment that you're getting right here on Plant Based Homestead Prepper with my honey, Roderick Chappelle. When you're done, pop over to my channel at Heart Speak Warriors Forum, where we will take ordinary people and listen to their extraordinary stories. Hope to see you guys there. Hi, I'm Christina, and you are watching Plant Based Homestead Prepper subscribe 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 all right so i took the liberty of doing some math real quick so if you're doing 260 calories each okay so that's a serving of rice and a serving of beans which comes up to 260 calories what i did i took the average person at 1500 calories okay that you would need just to survive. Now you could take it down to a thousand, you can take it up to two thousand, but I just took the average calorie of fifteen hundred. All right, and I divided that by the two sixty, which came up to roughly about five point five, and then I took the amount of servings that were in the twenty pound bag of rice, which were two o two. And you guys check my math on this. So there was two hundred two servings, and I came up with. If you had 16 pounds of beans and you had 20 pounds of rice, you would be able to roughly do 1,500 calories a day, roughly in 39 days. It will last you roughly 39 days. But like I said, depending on how many how many calories you're doing. Now, if you're rationing, it will take you know a lot. It would it will go out and stretch a lot further. If you're burning through that, or if you if you have multiple people, then you're going to go through that much faster. Now, I know Bear Independence teaches that you should have 750 pounds of food per person per year stored up. So, take that as a uh, as a basis, and remember, get you some spices because beans and rice and rice and beans are gonna get old real quick. Get you some spices, get you some gravy, get you some sugar, get you some I don't know seasoning salts, some bouillon cubes some uh, mushroom cream of mushrooms cream of broccoli and it's not even such thing uh, broccoli broth chicken broth whatever to, to just make the taste a little bit better but rice and beans beans and rice that is the staple of prepper food so hopefully this helps and i will see you guys and make sure you look you 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 since you made it all the way through Click up here and you should be able to see a um, another video that is tailored just for you. Make sure you subscribe, comment, like, and share because sharing is caring. We need you guys. So thank you, thank you, thank you.